Next is question number C. That's a third equation for this following one. Here the question is CH3, CH, BR, CH2, CH3. Now this particular compound is treated with NaOH and on arrow we have water molecule. So here first thing is let's name this compound. On second position of a 4 carbon chain I have a bromine atom. So this is going to be 2 bromo butane as the compound 2 bromo butane. We have NaOH but here the condition is with water. So when it's with water this is nothing but aqueous NaOH because it is mixed with water. The minute it is, it is it is mixed with water and you get an aqueous KOH or NaOH, this will act as a nucleophile. NaOH is going to act as a nucleophile. And what does a nucleophile do? It will replace another leaving group in the compound. So here, because Br is more electronegative in the compound, Br is the leaving group. So now when we do reaction, since NaOH is going to be a nucleophile, the OH minus over here is going to replace the Br. So when we do that, we will get at second position OH and that Br is going to form bond with Na to give NaBr. So what has happened? OH minus being the nucleophile is going to replace Br to give an alcoholic compound. Why is this happening? Because NaOH is in the aqueous medium. It's not in the alcoholic medium. So when I try to name this compound on a second carbon of a 4 carbon chain, I have an OH group. So this is going to be butane 2 all. So one thing that you need to remember is if NaOH is acting as in the aqueous medium, it is going to be a nucleophile, which means it will replace the leaving group. And if NaOH or KOH is in the alcoholic medium, they will act as a base and the function of a base is to abstract a proton. To know this particular function, it is more important for questions like these. So learn this as this is very important to identify in any organic reaction.